It looks like the weather's going to be nice out there in California and here in Maryland for uh, watching the game. Uh, it was a nice day today, too. We had plenty of sunshine. Temperatures made it uh, slightly above average. The normal high is 43. We made it up to 44. The record for today, 72, set back in 2008. Temperatures right now are in the upper 30s and low 40s. And again, for this time of the year, not too bad. Uh, 38 in Catonsville. Same thing in Parkton. It's 38 degrees in rising sun and we've got a nice area of high pressure parked here in the mid-atlantic that's going to keep the weather quiet all the way through the tail end of the weekend so you know, we've been talking about snow at the top of the show but that's not all coming in until monday and tuesday so with this here uh, we should wind up with just a mix of sun and clouds tomorrow and that's what we have on the satellite right now just a few high thin clouds and that's all you can expect as we head into tomorrow morning all right let's talk about this uh, complicated weather setup as we go into monday and tuesday the storm that we're talking about is just getting organized down here off the southeast coast see a lot of rain in florida and up into the Carolinas. It's going to turn into a pretty strong one, but I think fortunately for us, it's going to be a near miss and it's going to stay far enough to the east that we don't get into the bullseye snow with this storm. So let's take a look at it on Insta Weather Futurecast. This is 7 o'clock in the morning tomorrow. You see the first hints of the storm coming in from the south. We'll get through most of the day on Sunday with no problems and just a few clouds thickening up as we go into the afternoon. Let's set the time frame into Monday morning now. You see how close this storm comes to Baltimore. I think they're going to get some snow over in the eastern shore, maybe even uh, as close as uh, maybe Harford, Cecil County to get some snow out of this on Monday morning. But that should continue to move off to the north and east and leave us alone. And a weaker system behind that will come in from the northwest, more like a clipper storm. You can see some snow around Pittsburgh in the afternoon and evening on Monday. That will sweep through Baltimore Monday night and Tuesday and give us a pretty good chance for some snow. But at this time, it doesn't look like a big deal. When we get snow from clipper storms, just a couple inches most of the time. When we get snow from those coastal storms, that's when we get the big snow amounts. And it looks like we're going to miss that one on Monday. So that's good. We'll keep an eye on it, though, because it's close. Clear to partly cloudy tonight. Temperatures dropping back into the upper 20s and low 30s. During the day tomorrow, mixture of sunshine and a few clouds. I'm going to call it a pleasant day for Super Bowl Sunday. High temperatures will be above average between 44 and 49. The normal high is 43. Seven-day forecast looks like this. A good chance for some snow showers coming in by Monday afternoon. Snow is likely Monday night and Tuesday. Again, right now it just looks like a couple of inches, but we'll keep an eye on it and we'll see how close that first storm comes because it's really important. 35 for high temperature on Tuesday. Breezy cold for the rest of the week with perhaps some snow showers on Wednesday and Friday.